up buddy nerdigans this is the one and only packer girl 89 and today's manga nerdigan live reaction video is going to be for how not to summon a demon lord chapter 74.2 through 75.1 so before i get into this recap and live reaction let me just remind you to hit that like share and subscribe buttons and because of course this channel let alone this video are not sponsored and i'm just on a non-stop high speed struggle train heading into chaos Oh, and it's getting faster by the minute. If you love what I'm doing and want to help keep this channel alive and a kick in, feel free to hit up my Cash App and PayPal. Those links are in the description box below. And bam, we are facing the Dark Elves. And the Dark Elves, I swear to God, the costumes they are wearing up in here are the cutest things ever, and I want one. They look like something you would get at Hot Topic, too. Let's be goddamn real. And if I can find one, oh, man, I might actually cosplay <laughs> Oh, God, but again, that would require money, which, ooh, I'm in a deeper sinkhole than uh, than what the um, sinker Chojin has created up in Chojin X. Woo! Anyway, let's get to this chapter, see what's in store for us today. So we're starting off with 74.2. Don't move! The bear spoke? Oh, no shit, the bear spoke! Well, why are they angry? Um, are those dark elves? What an attitude! Even though we defeated the demonic beast for them, I think we startled them. Well, yeah, I'd be startled too, but I'd be at least grateful. But whatever. Pointing your bows at Master is unforgivable. Wait, Ro Rose, woman, calm down! They aren't alert because they were shocked by the power of the magic. Eh, no problem. Diablo, what are you... Uh, the me right now is confident. I am different from the me in the original world. Since coming to this world, I've talked with a lot of people, and also have people who I can call friends. Now, I might even say that I'm good at communicating. First, smile. A friendly conversation starts with a good facial expression. Being underestimated is, is not good, so let's act dignified when talking to them. <laughs> I am Diablo. I am taking an interest in the ritual magic passed down in this land, which means I have no business with you. Take me to the Dark Elves. <laughs> you idiot! Oh my god! True, they're scared, huh? Diablo, I should have went instead. Ugh, what? <laughs> Splendid! Hey, you... What was that just now? Uh, to defeat the master of the Black Forest in one hit. It's simply wind element. Uh, oh my god. It's simply wind element magic, though. Coo -coo -coo. If you're so interested, I could show you other magic, too. Though I might burn down the whole forest with fire magic. What? Uh, I said I'll show them magic if they become my guide, and I warned them that fire magic is dangerous, right? Or dangerous, but why are they nervous? Because you said it, that fire magic might burn down the whole forest, and that scared them. Like, you know what? I'm gonna give you Diablo this though. At least you ain't coming in all beta. <laughs> if you were coming in beta male style, oh no, nah. no, no, no. These dark elves would walk right all over you, and they would probably murder you. So you know what, Diablo, I'll give you, I'll give you points for coming in all alpha male. <laughs> well, that's where you're gonna get points is because of that. Um, let's see. If I don't hurry and prepare for the war against demonic beings, uh, the mortal races will perish, you know. How long are we going to stand here and talk? Hurry up and guide me. Do you want to die? I... Um, okay, I will guide you to the village of the Dark Elves, but can you promise to not hurt the villagers? <laughs> oh my god, see? He's going alpha male. See, you gotta show... Again, like, even though what um, Diablo said at first was like, like a holy shit moment, what the fuck? That was a little too strong. It's better than being, like, full-on beta male. It, it is. Like, you gotta show these mofos who's boss. You gotta be alpha. You gotta be the alpha male. <laughs> you do! Or the alpha female. They'll respect a- they'll respect- These dark elves will respect a strong-ass woman. You just gotta show them who's boss. I know it's a pissing contest with these mofos. <laughs> it is! It really is when it comes to other races like this. Of course! I knew it! My communication skills are improving! <laughs> I was able to ask nicely this time. 
This is asking nicely. Yeah, and if he wasn't asking nicely, the forest would be burned down. <laughs> Are we seriously bringing that dangerous guy to the village? How do we how do we fight someone who defeated the master of the Black Forest in one hit? Let's leave it to the elders. <laughs> We're like, yeah, we ain't dealing with this. So the dark elves um, path that Shara told us about was hidden. Yeah, well, duh, it was hidden. Oh, let me read this again. I'm sorry. So the dark elves path that, that uh, Shara told us about was hidden. I wouldn't lie. The entrance was obvious in the game. Good thing I didn't act smug and lead the way. Whew. Yeah, that was probably a good idea. I couldn't ask earlier, but are you guys dark elves? Yes, we are the only ones that uh, live in this forest. The only other things are beasts and bugs. I want to see them without the costumes, but damn, those costumes are cute. Um, I understand why they wear them, though, because, it, as I said right here, the only other things are beasts and bugs. They're probably doing this, uh, wearing this as kind of like a camouflage, because the beasts are probably really fucking stupid. <laughs> And um, the beast won't, won't attack them otherwise, maybe? Or trying to blend in, it's like a camouflage kind of thing. If that's the case, that's actually pretty smart. But are the demonic beasts, or just beasts in general, that stupid? I kind of want to say yes. I really hope, I kind of hope they're not that stupid, but yeah, they probably are that stupid. Don't go near the black grass. They're all poisonous. Eh? The black grass is everywhere, though. Woo! Even demonic beasts brought because of the poison, right? It's like playing a game of hot lava up in this forest. So that was why... Yeah! Yeah. The beasts are that stupid. That's why the disguises work. So that was why. The beasts in this forest make use of the poison as their weapon instead. You should be careful if you fight them. Thank you for the warning. I see. The costume protects them from the poisonous grass. Dude, that's a double win right there. So the costumes protect them from, from the grass. And, like, you could kind of camouflage from the other beasts, too. That's actually pretty smart. But why is it a bear? Well, it's not just because they're cute. I think it's because, as I said, I think it's as camouflage from the other beasts. Because they'll see the beast, uh, the demonic beast will see the beast and whatnot. Or it may not be that, it actually might be bait too. I don't know, I'm curious, what do you guys think? Do you guys think this is camouflage? Or do you think it's to be used as bait? Because they want to bring out the demonic beast so they can hunt them. I'm curious what you guys think. Let me know in the comment section. We're here. Woo, okay. So, this is the Dark Elf's country? Isn't it small? Yes. Even though um, you're uh, both elves, it's quite different from what you said of your homeland. It's completely different from Greenwood Kingdom. Well, their way of life doesn't matter. Any... Well... It matters to me. I want to know. Anyway, I should um, go to find out about the ritual magic. Hmm. Huh? Huh? Mm. The most important goal for coming to the Dark Elves country is the ritual magic. There is no mistake, but... Hmm. But I feel like there was another goal. Hmm. Hmm? Uh, I remember what the other goal is. Woo! Wifeys! Hello, Dark Elf wifeys. Hmm. See, this is what I like to see. <laughs> ah, I like seeing titties. I like seeing ass. I do, because I'm. So, here's the thing. Yes, I'm bi, for one thing. Two, I like admiring the human body in general. Even if I wasn't bi, I would. And three, the erasure of women in Western entertainment pisses me off. So, I feel like I get to be represented. I do. As a big, titted woman, I get to be represented up in here. And that's always nice to see. Oh, God. Thank God. Thank God for manga. Thank you. Thank you, Maga. Look at them tits. Dude, that is a nice ass shot, too. These dark elves look so good. 
Just like in the game. No, they have bigger titties in the game. You know what this slide says right here? It says the game is censored. The game is censored one and two. God damn it. And they're topless too. This is paradise. Oh my God, this is paradise. I feel unpleasant for some reason. <laughs> the titty in me. Even the sound of pouring water sounds lewd. This is paradise. Oh, this is titty paradise. Oh my god, this is. Chapter 75 is titled Trying to um Trying Out Going to the Forest of the Dark Elves Part 2. Dude, this is paradise. Super huge titties. So big! Yes! Pretty big, huh? Is is, is that so? I was looking at the forest, so did you catch me looking at the huge titties? Oh, they're big old titties. Yes, they are. That one is the first time I've seen that one. Um, I've seen one that big. Hmm? This, is, <laughs> this is paradise too. See, even though it's a treehouse, it's not huge. Huh? Treehouse? Um, that seems to be the Dark Elves Palace. Dude, that is beautiful. I'm not gonna lie. Wow, look, uh, look, look, Diablo. Oh my god. Wow, look, look, Diablo, it's huge. Hmm? I saw it. It's a large palace constructed with wood. Not that, I'm talking about how the Dark Elves all have big boobs. <laughs> this time it's that? What are you saying, Shara? Our lives could be in danger here and you're being inappropriate. Well, th that's true, but it's seriously amazing, though. M my apologies. Hey! Shara has good taste. What, what can I say? And, hey, and maybe it's because... Shara is um, a part of the big titty club that she appreciates it too. I don't know. Maybe it's because Shara is bi. Maybe I'm just assuming. Or maybe just Shara just admires beautiful titties. I don't know. I really am starting to think that Shara... Like, I've been thinking this the whole time. I'm really starting to think Shara is bi. And I don't care. That's awesome. She can be bi. Let her be bi. Let her be cur or bi curious. They're, they're big. So what? Titty envy. That is titty envy right there. Only, only girls um, that are washboards. I'm sorry, small tittied women. Sorry, washboards. I have to say it because it's true. Only those with washboards would say that. <laughs> They're big, so what? Not only that, but um, it's usually, and I've noticed it lately, it's been Karen saying this. Karen's and Meg's are saying um, they're big, so what? Yeah, so what? You wish you had them. <laughs> and there's magic up in here. Wait a minute. Wouldn't there be magic to make your tits big? Come on, man. I want to see big titty magic. Let's go. Bring it. Is this where the chief is? Hmm? Oh, even the one inside that um, bear costume has huge tits. Holy shit! Damn, she is fine. Yes, I can... Hey, let me enjoy my thirst. She is fine as fuck. Holy crap. So you are a girl. Uh, this costume protects our bodies from the poison um, poison grass. Other than the um, other than the babies, all the men go off to work far away. Are you saying this is like the Amazon... Uh, this is like Amazonians kind of thing? Holy shit, that's bomb. Okay, but damn, this ass shot is great. I'm not saying it's too dangerous for women, but I'd want a tanky um, uh, frontline if I were fi uh, if I were to fight demon. Uh, oh my god, I want a uh, tanky frontline if I were fighting demonic beasts. Can't deny that. Well, usually, even if the Lord of the Blackwood approaches the village, he uh, he normally leaves it after being threatened. But I wonder what went down for it to be so bloody. Hmm. Still, I am grateful to our guests for defeating the Lord of the Blackwood. However, we don't welcome other races here, especially elves racist much it doesn't seem like she's realized that Shira is the um that Shira is the princess yet anyway maybe if she does that'll be very interesting if she already knows that Shara is the princess that would be fucking hilarious but if she doesn't that's gonna be even more hilarious but anyway um guests over here please uh, please appeal to the chief amicably I've got strong communication skills uh, now. So, oh my god, I've got strong communication skills now, so this is no problem. Um, 
do not worry. Haven't we uh, been sufficiently sufficiently amicable? Oh my god, I just realized this too. I can't. Even, you know what sucks? Because YouTube is pro YouTube has been a pain in the ass. I can't even have the big titty elves up in my thumbnail because YouTube will take it down. I could wear low cut tops in my videos, but having a big teen elf up in my thumbnail or having big teen women up in my um, thumbnails is a big no-no, apparently. Fucking assholes. Seriously, YouTube, get over it. Quit having titty envy. If you were my enemy, I would have burned uh, the force to the ground now. Of course, everyone has to get along, okay? Damn it! Diallo, shut up! What? They had to cover for me? Um, I, I thought I'd been, I thought I'd improve my communication skills, but I guess this means I'm still socially inept? The shock! The shock of it all! Well, yeah. The chief is behind this. Um, don't be rude. If she turns on me, I, I will destroy, uh, her. Uh, we'll be careful. Hello, chief! Damn, woman! Dude, how does your back not hurt? Dude, those are titties. Holy shit. Woman, I am surprised that your titties are not uh, up in the armrest. Like, how? That has to... Dude, my tits are hurting from that. How? Dude, oh my god, I feel so bad for you, woman. I do. Oh, man. Oh, God. I know it's weird that I'm imagining this, but again, this is coming from someone who is well in doubt. I can only imagine um, the amount of underboob sweat that you are dealing with. That sucks. That really sucks. Oh, God. Well met, esteemed guests. I am Rafalesia S. Orangewood. Enormous. Uh, rather than huge tits. <laughs> rather than huge tits, I'm straight up demonic. Um, look at it, look at Inner Diablo, he's like, oh my god, I am the adventurer, Rem, uh, Rem Kaleu, oh my god, I can't get over this, these tits are bigger than my head, oh my god, these tits are way bigger than my head, holy shit, um, I'm Shara, uh, you got some big, oh my god, Shara, you bitch, you got some big breasts, from Celia. <laughs> Too direct. I, you know why? I probably would say the same thing. I, I would not. Uh, I would. Be, I, I would be saying the same thing. I'm not gonna lie. I believe our guest here is an elf. Am I mistaken? Uh. uh um. <laughs> well, more importantly, you're elven royalty, isn't that right? H how did you? Uh, oh. Um. How'd she find out? What elven royalty? She said. Are you dumb? Why do you deny it? But why, it's true that I'm, I'm the princess. Dark elves hate the elves, right? If they know you're from the royal family on top of that, but the royal family have a distinctive aura, you know. The dark elves were betrayed by the elves. Oh, that's right. That's why we're here, because we have to talk to them about what's happened with the royal family. Um, we especially harbor resentment towards the current king. Well, the current king is dead. A grudge, but this is the first time I've ever seen a dark elf, though. Is that so? However, even if you forget what you did to us, we will never forget. Um, not for a hundred years, a thousand years. That's... The situation suddenly took a turn for the worse, huh? What should we do? It's the same as that time in the great church. Retreat will only bring about the worst outcome. I believe in my companions, but in the end, uh, my demon lord roleplay is the best. Bickering is annoying. Listen up, dark elves. Oh, God, this is going to be interesting. I am Diablo, the demon lord from another world. I don't know anything about your petty grudges or whatever. If you don't want to regret your life, you should just follow me. Demon lord? As, expect, uh, as expected, elves cannot be trusted. As if we'll let you do whatever you please. Stop! Woo! Damn. Yeah, this is Amazonian realness. That's what this is. We got the Amazons here. I love, I love it. But yeah, oh, this is big titty paradise. Oh my God, this is big titty paradise. Woo, I'm, 
dude, I am envious of them. That their titties are that their backs aren't hurting, nor are they getting under boob sweat. Like, why is there two of the magic there must be fantastic? I wanna know what magic they're using! Because I would totally love to use this. I need this magic. I do. But god damn! Damn! But the, the other thing, as I said, that I really like about these chapters is that I love that, <laughs> I love that Diablo basically said that these tits are bigger than they were in the game and they're topless here because you know what that means. That means that the game was censored. And I don't know if, the, um, because I know this is an adaptation of the light novel. I do not know if this was in the light novel or not. So if you are a reader of the light novel, I want to know if this was mentioned in the light novel or if this is new or not because i'm very curious because of what's been happening in um in video games lately because women have been censored and erased from a lot of uh, video games and it's only getting worse so i want to know if this is true um if this was in the uh in the light novels or not because if it was then that's just like that's just uber insane and uber meta <laughs> But God, I love this. I love, I love, 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 love this. And you know what? Even if it wasn't in, if, even if it was in the light novel, it really does fit regardless because it's usually, if we're going to go like the angel demon route, regardless, um, it's usually the demons, the darker ones. And I'm not talking about race. I'm just talking about demons. Mythologically speaking, it's always the demons that get to have more fun, that are more loose, that are more freeing. Whereas angels are supposed to be more pure, more, um, more constricted. So like seeing this in comparison to like, say, um, like the elves, it makes more sense. And I really like that. I like that we have this going on. I do. Um, but I want to know more about how the dark elves were betrayed by the elves. The current king, current king is dead. So mm, this will be interesting to see how things go from here. Cause I was thinking I might make a, like a Lilith comparison to this, especially since her titties are the biggest, but, hmm. <laughs> but now nah, I can't make a Lilith comparison to this. Ah. Unless, you know what, here's how you can make a Lilith comparison. If, uh, if the king was trying to, um, get busy with her and she was like, no, we ain't ha I ain't having this shit. And the king just decided to say, fuck you and betray the dark elves, some shit like that. Yeah. Uh, I would not be down. I would be fine with that and make that a Lilith comparison. Sure. Let's, we can go with that. It'll be interesting to see how, um, the manga executes it. Let me know your thoughts in the comment section below what you guys thought of these chapters. What do you guys think of Big Titty Paradise? Oh, God, I love it. I love it, love it, love it! Oh, I feel so represented. I do. It's good, it's good, it's good. Let me know your thoughts in the comment section below. And remember to like, comment, share, and subscribe to Nerdigan Zinc. If you love what I'm doing, I want to help uh, keep this channel alive and kicking so I can keep bringing you more. Um, how not to summon a demon lord content. There's a few ways you could do that. You could donate to my cash app, PayPal, Patreon, purchase something off my Amazon wish list. All that's in the description box below. Also, make sure you follow me on Twitter, Twitch, Discord, find me on PlayStation Network. That's in the description box below as well. Till next time, Nerdigans, I'll be seeing you later. Bye.